If I were to ask you how much this container holds, you'd probably tell me about a quart or a liter. So let's check that hypothesis. Wait a minute, my, my container has a hole in it. It's not filling up. The purpose of this demonstration is to talk about Liebig's Law of the Minimum, which states that plants grow in response to the most limiting nutrient, or most limiting factor. In this case, we have water and oxygen showing down here at the bottom of the container is the most limiting. In the west, uh, southwest, where things are dry, arid, semi-arid environments, water is the most limiting factor for plant growth. Without water, plants don't grow. In much of the Midwest, where the soils have high water tables, uh, poorly drained, then oxygen was the most limiting factor, and they came in and they drained many of the soils, lowered the water table so that they'd be able to introduce oxygen to the root zone. Once we meet the need of a plant for oxygen and water, we increase the potential of the plant for growth until we reach the next most limiting factor. And in this case, that next most limiting factor for most plants is nitrogen. So then if we come in and we add some nitrogen fertilizer, we, we can, again, increase our yield potential until another factor comes, becomes limiting. And in this case, that other factor is phosphorus. Now, if phosphorus is the limiting factor, it does no good to come in with a potassium fertilizer or with a micronutrient application because those are not the limiting factors for plant growth. As long as those are, phosphorus is the most limiting factor, adding additional nutrients of other sorts is not going to increase the plant yield. Now, you can, the other thing you can see is that there's a slow leak. This demonstrates for us that the system is not 100% efficient. Not every nutrient, plant nutrient that we apply in, in terms of fertilizer in the soil gets into the plant. So there you have it. Liebig's Law of the Minimum states that plants grow in response to the most limiting factor.